I'm Tracy Blackwell and I live in Otley, West Yorkshire and I'm very lucky to be a dry stone waller. A dry stone wall is a structure that's built with no cement. It's only gravity and friction and the skill of the person placing the stones that holds the whole structure together. It's essentially two sides to the wall, two skins, um, and it's built in an A shape so that it's wider at the base than it is at the top and then it has stones put onto the top called cope stones, which hold the two sides together. It's a very, very strong structure that can last for hundreds or even up to thousands of years. Everyday life outdoors is my lifeblood, really. I couldn't imagine not being able to be outside. It's, it's where I feel I belong. Uh, I used to work in the theatre when I was younger, and I'd spend 12 hours in a dark space with no windows. There's no way at all in the world I could go back to that environment again because out here is really where I belong. It's really difficult to say that I have any one piece of clothing that's essential in this job because I need things to keep me dry when it's raining, things to keep me warm when it's cold, and things to keep me cool when it's hot. But if I had to really name one item that I couldn't possibly manage without, it would really be this vest which you can see it's taken an awful lot of wear and it really does get worn every day at some point, whether it's first thing in the morning, in the summer or all day in the winter over all the layers that I wear. But I really couldn't manage without this at all. Um, I think traditionally construction jobs have always been in the male preserve and it's only now that women are beginning to realise that it's something that they can do. There's no reason a woman can't be a dry stone waller and why should the guys have all the fun? At the end of the day, when you clear back the site and you see what you've been doing, there's a tremendous sense of achievement and pride that I couldn't possibly imagine obtaining if I'd been in an office moving pieces of paper around all day. You can really see what you've done. Uh, this wall's going to get rebuilt later on this year. It may not look in too bad condition, but once it's finished, uh, I feel as though there's a part of me that I will have left here forever as long as the wall stands.